Alright everybody, and here is the grudge match. I won the die roll, I would like to go first. This is Cerulean. Now uh, as per the story, and this has just been my luck, hasn't it? As per the storyline, if you have been paying attention, I'll keep it, why not? If you have been paying attention, then Cyrulean and I battled with uh, my Battlegate deck last uh, last time, and he found it quite unfair. More to the point, I stomped him, and well, he didn't like it. He called me out on it, and apparently I didn't have permission to use Aurelia's uh, troops. So. Long story short, oh, he really he he went and made slivers. Okay. Long story short, um, my battlegate spells. That did not bode well. My battlegate spells. Um. Well, got stolen from me, and so I had to make a new deck. There's a lord, and this is really going nowhere fast. You served your purpose. Get in front of the truck. I'm just going to concede this. Because I only have two mana. I'm sorry, one mana. Um, I'm thinking... Thinking Stinkweed, because he's not going to want to attack with his lords. Let's see if I can pull this around, because that was absolutely pathetic. Which seems to be my luck recently, of just getting one mana opening hands. Let's see... He got the first match. Yes, I want to go first. One mana. A little bit better. That's ridiculous. Uh, for the record, at the time of this taping, I believe that's one, two, three, four of my f last five individual matches have contained one mana opening hands. I don't know what the probability is on that, but I'm pretty sure it's ridiculously low. So here it actually is something that can you know actually help us. We came into our edge of divinity. So we now have a four four life link beat stick. He'll probably be able to recover from that, but journey to nowhere, and my Gwynlin is gone, and so is my edge. Well, I'm going to play down my other Gwynlin. I'm going to drop my swamp, my third swamp, and say go. But at least I got my four in. Down to two cards, he's at six. He's got all the mana he needs in order to start playing out everything. 
Yeah, this is just this a foil muscle sliver. I can't play that. Um, I'm gonna unmake it. It ceases to exist. And my nipple come in and hit for one. He's back up to six. There's another lord. And a plated. This really is going to be the rage deck for the next little bot while. Much like uh Well, I'm gonna cast that on there. Um the slivers are going to be the rage deck for the next little while. Just like uh, the Cyclops deck was. Yep, I will do that. I will definitely take out the Lord, leaving the plate out alive. And we'll play down another nip. Oh, that's two Lords down. Ten to go. Um, I can get some white mana. That would be fun. As a metallic sliver. Yeah, I can't do much against it. I'm not even going to bother blocking. I've got a buffer in there. Yep. So, yeah. Another journey to nowhere. It looks like I'm going to have to just... Tuck my tail between my legs. Yeah, I'm going to just save that one because it's going to be fun to throw it out mid-combat. But if something else doesn't happen, the Sentinels, so they'll all get vigilant, or vigilance, sorry. Oh, that's stupid powerful. Yeah, cast for three black. Three of twelve lords. Gone. I'll take my two. White mana would be nice. All slivers have reach. No, that doesn't bode well for me, given my deck premise. And sitting back and doing nothing. So yeah, I guess this definitely is revenge for him. Hive stirrings. I'm gonna remove a sentinel sliver while I'm so, at the very least, he'll have to tap. I should have saved it for the muscle. Mm, 
No blockers. Guess you get your revenge after all. There's the part that the entire deck is based off of. He can save his father from himself, and I can go back to being a true pauper. As if you read the story at all, all of these cards, they don't belong to me. I had to make deals. I had to make deals with the Orzov. And yeah. Looks like none of it mattered. Cyrulean gets his revenge. I hand my spells back to the Orzov Syndicate. And I end up right back at square one with nothing. <laughs>